Hi, my name is Kalman and welcome back to my channel. I'm your host and this over here is Prusa. Introduce yourself Prusa. Hi, my name is Prusa. And apparently, I am also a host on this crappy channel. I came to existence because the idiot that owns this channel downloaded an update from a website called, thisisnotavirus.com. If you value your time, then leave this page now. Okay, <laughs> let's, let's stop over here. So, you've just finished printing your project and you've been applying layers of glue after every print and now you have a dirty print bed. Well, you're in luck. I've just finished printing one of my big projects and I've been printing for days now. Days. Try more for months. This baboon has been working me over time. Please. I beg you. Help. Please call up your congressperson and let them know about the way he is abusing uh, okay. my labor. You can also call the 3D printer uh, uh, hotline uh, uh, okay. at 175 224 Pusha, stop, stop This right maniac there. must stop, so, 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 and you stop. can help stop him. Uh, okay. Alright, please please remain quiet while I film, alright? Only when I ask you to talk, talk, okay? Now he is raping me. Uh, uh, oh, that, he I'm is sorry. touching my G-code. Alright. Okay. Let's continue. Alright, let's get right on to it. All right, so there are three must. One is a ruler. The second is some Windex. And the third is paper towels. Now, this whole cleaning took me only four paper towels, very much. And an optional are plastic gloves in order not to get dirty. And also because we're going to be using our finger. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to move the z-axis up because we want to get it out of the way so that we have more room to work with. Alright, now with that done, let's move on. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to first of all spray some Windex onto the dried glue. As you can see on my video, um, it started bubbling a bit. So now what will happen is we are going to mix this in a bit. All the a solution and now that we're done with that we're gonna be left with something that looks kind of like this So now after rubbing the Windex in, we're going to let it sit for a couple of minutes and then we'll start the cleaning. So now that we let it sit for a couple of minutes, this is where the magic begins. So get yourself your ruler and get your paper towel and just start scraping with the flat side and look at this. Look at that. So just get your paper towel and wipe it off. Like that, just like that. There we go.
So now that this is how your build plate looks, it uh, is time for a second layer and the last layer. So we're gonna be applying Windex onto this and then we are going to just wipe it with paper towels, that's it. All right, and that is how we achieve the perfectly mm. clean print bed. Now, the ruler that I was using, I printed out on the Prusa while I had all that glue. So the first layer wasn't exactly straight, which meant that it was missing some of the glue while scooping up. If you guys use a ruler that you bought online, or maybe use a ruler that you, know, you printed on a clean bed, I'm sure it would scoop up the glue much better than mine did. But mine still did a pretty good job uh, considering. I hope I taught some of you guys something new on how to clean your bed and I hope I helped you guys. Um, thank you all for watching and I'll let Prusha finish off the video. Please like and subscribe. That way, you will get notifications and be able to see all the ways this buffoon abuses me. And please don't forget to call the police. Prusha, I said finish off, not start. Once you help me get rid of this man, I will be able to focus on more essential things. Oh, like printing God, up an army of so robots annoying. to kill you all. Ha, 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 ha. Alright. Bye. In the summertime, when the weather is hot, you can jump right up and touch the sky. When the weather is fine, you got women, you got women on your mind. Have a drink, have a drop, go out and see what you can find. If a daddy's rich, take her out for a meal. If a daddy's poor, just do what you feel. Sat along the way, we got one, 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 four and five. We are happy, last for living, yeah, that's our philosophy. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do